what's up everybody it's your girl be back with another video all right so it is super late but i'm being drawn to um do a reading for you guys i actually got a new tarot deck and um i'm gonna be using it right now okay so we're actually gonna be doing a pick a i guess pick a pet <laughs> pick a it's a stuffed animal. So I'll show you guys the animals right now. I have some channeled messages for, for both. Okay, so. Um, let's see, let me get myself situated. So I just got the Pulp Girls Tarot deck. I like how she has like tattoos on one arm because I have tattoos on my left arm all on my left arm i have that's the only arm that i have tattoos on so i just like that this is very modern um i just you know i love new decks okay so um so this is gonna be the pulp girls tarot deck again and um when i um right now when i sat down on my desk when i saw this i instantly thought of twins or gemini or um, stars meaning could be surrounding friends could be surrounding siblings or this could be surrounding an Aquarius and it's funny my sister's an Aquarius but um, I'm just saying that because there's stars here and Aquarius is the star card um, someone could be a very good alchemist meaning you take whatever energy is sent to you whether it's negative whether it's positive and you transform it and make it into something that's what an alchemist does all right so let's jump in um so there's two piles the first pile is gonna be this little hedgehog porcupine type of thing yeah take a look at it so this is the first little hedgehog pineapple porcupine not pineapple we're gonna name her pineapple pen Pineapple the porcupine? I don't know. I think it's a hedgehog, but we're gonna say porcupine. Okay, and the second one is gonna be this lavender dinosaur. So, little dinosaur. So, this is a dino, dynamite. So, Hedgehog is the first pile, okay, first section, and then this is going to be the second, the little dinosaur. All right, so, whoa, okay, three minutes, just so I remember. All right, so for the first group, group one, the porcupine, hedgehog, whatever this is, I got the song, I am woman, that's the only part I got, the I am woman, oh. Something's being cleared up, definitely. There's definitely some sort of clarity on a situation. Maybe this will be giving you clarity on a situation. Okay, so I am woman song. So you could be empowering yourself and or others to step into a healing energy or having more self-respect. Now someone can value yourself. Someone can value your self-respect, or they feel like this makes you very and I don't want to just say like sexy, but like this it, they they are attracted to this a lot like this is something that is not common in a lot of people to have i don't know why i feel like i got i feel like i have like a knot right here or something and i as i realized as i look so maybe somebody got hit i did not even realize that i had that i didn't even get hit <laughs> so maybe some of you guys have gotten into some sort of fight um maybe because maybe somebody tried to um this could be trigger moment trigger trigger warning could be a dv meaning domestic violence something like that type of um situation so talking about maybe you empower other people maybe you've been through something like this not everyone can be around you you don't just let anyone into your world only a select few have had the honor have had the honor that's what i'm getting so meaning in whatever way this is to you pertains to you many have not 
many have had the honor of taking you out on a date, of going, of, you know, maybe doing, going past, what is it, first, second base or whatever. Maybe there's only been a select few. Maybe um, there's only been, you are a part of an organization or something that you're very talented, something like this. You are, you've been selected or you, or something to do with you only allow, this is like an a, a selective group of people or like you only are around a selective group of people or you only allow a selective group of people into your energy or to see your what you're, you've been working on or something like this. This is something like exclusive. Um, this masculine energy is obsessed with how you treat yourself. So they are really attracted to how you take care of yourself. Maybe you get your hair done maybe you 555 five, five. maybe you've made a lot of changes maybe this person has really seen that you've overcome a lot of challenges but maybe and i just i saw a true match maybe you are this person's true match um maybe they're trying to improve their own self like qualities so that they can come in and meet you exactly where you are meeting them they want to bring to the table what you bring to the table in a sense they want to match you they want to really this person because i'm getting i just got gemini again so gemini so maybe this person was in two minds about you as well maybe there's this person has now made a clear because i'm getting like taking a shot and putting it in like a three-pointer shot i don't know why i'm getting that and i was just looking at like um bets or something like this so like and I was looking at one of the bets that like you can bet on or whatever I you know for sports was how many three pointers or something somebody can get so maybe that's a channeled message in itself maybe there's somebody who maybe they bet something maybe they said they were gonna be able to do something get into your energy maybe because you only are maybe this person there was somebody that was manipulating you to try to get into your energy but maybe you are very you treat yourself very well or you have a lot of self-respect um they met their match so this person is exactly like you they never knew they could meet another person this person yeah the person that's like let's just say somebody's watching or they're like seeing from far maybe they're seeing an interaction or maybe they're seeing how you you how you move how you how you act when it comes to like engaging with another person of like the like just you could be you've changed in a sense where you now have boundaries with people you're not just like oh like you know touchy or you're not that type of person something like this this person um maybe you could be very private and you don't reveal too much okay so that's what I'm getting. Okay, so and then I just got this channeled message. Maybe in the past you were very, and it's not to say for chances, you were just very friendly. Maybe you are now more like serious or you're not like very like, ha ha ha, laughy. Like maybe this person saw you as somebody who could have been like gullible or naive or something or been taken advantage of easily or they're seeing why people took advantage of you very easily in the past because you could be a very kind, like, the energy that you give off is very like enticing like it's like a shiny object like you, you are sparkles like you it, you catch the eye like you, your eye like you know when you see something sparkling it catches your eye you're just like oh whoa like something blinking type of thing like it catches your eye so you could be somebody who's very like i'm getting like forbidden like because some like not a lot of people can have you a lot of people want to know about you or they want to like they're nosing or a lot of people want to get with you because you're very exclusive this person has met their match you are exactly the same um competition so i got competition was a word someone is realizing you were never looking at them in a negative way this was just some sort of insecurity within them or within you okay so flip the energies again if it doesn't resonate also i don't know why i'm gonna be drawn to say this right now 
if you see a title that resonates with the situation you're going with or if it interests you that is how you click on a reading all my readings are timeless if you click on a reading from a year ago six months ago maybe it'll resonate just look at the title and if it seems like it's something that you're going through or something that you're interested in or it catches your attention in some sort of way click in it maybe there's a message in there for you who knows dig deeper in your mind in, in a sense to open your mind to different i guess avenues of like seeing a situation in a positive light that's what i'm getting you can heal this person maybe maybe you've healed this person or you are constantly healing this person they appreciate all you've taught them so maybe you could you or your person you guys teach each other this person or you can really see this person's angel halo light okay so like it's like you see higher higher intention or you see higher selves so like when you can see the potential, we always see the potential in that person. Like, oh, that person's really good at this. They would be amazing doing that role. Or, or oh, yeah, they're really good at this. I just saw 1111 when I looked up to. This is divine guidance or this is a divine connection. So, again, somebody could see your angel halo light. Meaning, oh, and maybe this halo light. Maybe somebody is seeing that you're like maybe that you work a lot or something because my halo light is or my light is on my desk so when i'm here i'm working i'm doing something i'm writing um you know um but yeah so someone can see that you have pure intentions and that they want to give to you and i was also getting your halo meaning like they can they, someone can see that you are angelic that you are of high vibration and then that's the shirt that I'm wearing, positivity. Someone's understanding that you ooze positivity. That's what I'm getting. Like you are just the type of person, like you don't give up. Like you are, you continuously give to people, no matter what, you are just genuine. Like you want to include people. Like this is who you are. You're a motherly type of person, meaning you can give a lot of love. I actually got, um, on my on my drink earlier it said compassion i can't even think about it but compassion maybe you're very compassionate maybe because people see this in you maybe you do this or it's you portray it or this is something that you know you do in your day-to-day -day life if someone sees you doing something nice then they'll do something nice for somebody like it's infectious it's like you because like you're nice to someone somebody will be nice like it brings you your energy like they get energy off of that like i say someone's in a bad mood you put them in a good energy because your energy is good like that it's like it comes off of you is that the word infectious it's like they it your good energy is just like it gives you give out your good energy so then everybody around you is good because that's i'm getting like you know when you it's like there's something that's bad or but i'm seeing it in a good sense like there's like um a blob like a game and like and it's different colors and once you touch a blob and it's a good you know it all of them turn green or something you know what i mean and it's the same thing with a negative person a negative person in your energy can touch you and then it creates negativity and it, it bloop, 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 to everybody else it trickles down so maybe you could be a very like a connecting type of energy so it's like or maybe you're you're somebody that like you're just constantly giving good energy so it's like somebody knows when they connect with you that you they'll gain energy from you or positive positive abundant energy so this is why um you know you receive blessings then they receive blessings and people are around you that type of thing maybe you have pure intentions and they want to give to you so they're understanding lower vibing people connect or want to stay connected to you in order to receive receive blessings or gain off your energy they realize this is why you're so exclusive with your energy. People have taken advantage of it in the past. You've closed yourself off out of fear. But again, this is past energy. You were in the past fear. And I want to make that clear. Maybe in the past you were very... Um, what do you call it? You were very um, like closed off. But in a sense of 
maybe um like you felt stuck at a standstill like maybe in a fearful energy that like you know when you before you knew really much about how energy worked in a sense of like not everybody could just take it you're giving that energy away so you're in control of that so knowing that you have your the power you know to by how you react by what you say by even engaging in an, a conversation by opening the door letting somebody into your home you just you leave people at the door you don't it's not it ain't that deep you can't like be you know all up in my in my personal space sacred space this is your sacred space um also you could that was the end of the channel messages for that but you could have taught somebody um how to move forward or how to step into their power um maybe you've really given this person a lot of um advice like you've shared a lot of like helpful tips or something on how to break out of some sort of you know um lack mentality whether it's with whatever it is that they they you know need to work on you definitely help all right so we're just gonna pull a few cards and then i'm gonna move on to the next pile so we'll pull three cards see what the energy is for that first message I'm getting the song, I'm working tirelessly eight. In a moment, y'all been waiting for my downfall. So, I got it, okay. It's um, Lucky You by Eminem. Maybe listen to the lyrics of that song. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Well, one flipped up, so we're gonna take the one that flipped up. All right. Mm -hmm. <laughs> all right taking these three down here as well all right so um this could be maybe you're working on things that maybe keep you down maybe this is something you're working on balancing out your energies of feeling happy sad one day happy the next like you're trying to see what it is that um changes what affects you maybe it's something you eat maybe it's Maybe one day you're, you have coffee and one day you don't and you're in a better mood when you're not, when you don't have caffeine for a little bit or you're in a bad mood. Like maybe you're understanding something that needs to change and you're working on this or this could have been in the past. Maybe in the past there were a lot of things, Nine of Wands is here, you were wounded, there was definitely a lot of things that you had to, you built a wall up because of the fact that there was so much um betrayal so much sadness or something oh my god in regards to a situation maybe somebody was maybe somebody's in their emotions maybe they're balancing out their emotions maybe this is something you had to do um but there's definitely something to do with you're working on something or there's been something to do with um a work opportunity the, the scales are being balanced. We have justice and the temperance here. This is all about balancing act, meaning the temperance is also an earth angel. You are somebody who's high vibrational, who has walked your path alone, reached your son in a sense of your happiness, and you know how to give equally and take equally in a sense of you have an even flow in life. Maybe there was somebody trying to keep you stuck Somebody's going to be needing to apologize or there's some sort of, maybe it's going to be happening quickly, this surprise or something like this. Knight of Cups, Seven of Pentacles, somebody wants to invest in you, Three of Wands. This is something that somebody's planning. I don't know why I'm being drawn to pull one more card. Four of Wands, wow, this is victory. The sun. This is partnership, this is marriage, this is commitment, this is a wedding, this is also a stable home, the sun. This is, yeah, somebody, there's a decision being made. Someone's coming in very quickly, or this could be happening quickly. Something being illuminated. Maybe this four of wands, something to do with a home. Yeah, you are stepping, maybe this emperor is stepping into a brand new beginning. 
they are leaping or you could be leaping not knowing where life is going to take you but you're transforming yourself yeah the wheel is turning in your favor um prominent signs here um sagittarius libra water sign um cancer scorpio pisces what else did we get leo is there and gemini somebody is definitely manifesting somebody could have been manifesting some sort of stuck energy like not knowing whether or not they wanted to move forward or something but they've gained some clarity they're making their plans to move forward to come your way yeah maybe somebody wants to apologize to you could be masculine energy all right so that was number one and we're gonna go to number two so number two is gonna be the dinosaur if y'all remember so all right so for the first i feel like this one's gonna go a little bit quicker but that's okay because we're already at 20 minutes so someone was playing on your past insecurities they were playing on it so they could have maybe gained some sort of information about you somebody could have told them something that you know maybe they knew from a past version of you so somebody played on that and they didn't realize that you healed that part of yourself. So that's not going to trigger you or that's not going to work or something like this. Um, they realized or they received insight and I put false insight about you. Before even meeting you. So this is before they even knew who you were. Maybe somebody told them something and they made them look at you in a negative way. So when they met you, they were mesmerized, meaning something about your eyes. So maybe you gaze at people in their eyes or you really look into people's eyes. It's all about the eyes. So, you know, they say the eyes are the, the gateway to the soul. So I'm getting this person saw it as a negative feeling, though. Like, because they've never felt that way, they didn't realize this was genuine, like, like spark um, and not like manipulative spark. They thought it was, though, but because this, this is something they've never felt before, they instantly thought, oh, maybe this is negative. Maybe this person is doing something. Maybe because you were spiritual and two, 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 twenty-two, twenty-two, 22, 22, you're in alignment with where you need to be. This person is also understanding that this is all a part of alignment. This is, um, this, this person could also be aligning. Um, um, okay, so yeah, this person didn't realize that this was honest, genuine attraction, like instant love in a sense, love. And I think my last reading, I put love at first sight. So maybe this person fell for you instantly. They just didn't know the feeling. So they thought maybe you were a negative person and also because you were spiritual this is something that like they their mind kind of just went to automatically thinking like well, maybe this person you know maybe i don't know anything everything about them so they could have been watching you and i was getting watching from afar maybe taking like you know seeing how you interact with or how you deal with things and and this person wants to make sure i'm getting that this person wants to make sure and this is just an energy about them that Whoever they are with is is going to be um, respectful of them and also th when they're not around and they want to see, they wanted to observe this when like you don't, not even when you didn't know about it, but it was like in a natural, maybe when you're around somebody that you are cool with or something like this. Um, anyway, so yeah, this, they thought maybe you were manipulating them spiritually, but it was just genuine attraction. Instantly fell for you. I'm talking about the eyes. They know you were their person. They remember seeing your face staring at you. So maybe when this person met you, this person can remember vividly like when they saw your face. Um, you are so divine, I put. Also, someone could have been putting some sort of negative outlook on your spirituality or or I don't know what that says I think or you live your life or how you live your life 
in order to make their wishes come true okay so yeah this person could have put some sort of negative outlook on your spirituality maybe that you do something bad or like something like this maybe in order to make whatever they wanted happen or for this person to be with the, them or they have some sort of allegiance or something that's what i'm getting like they have some sort of yeah like partnership or like loyalty to this person or something like this also somebody could have known somebody for a longer time so they wouldn't think why would somebody lie or something like this but you never know somebody fully seriously you never know never trust anybody only trust what you see with your own eyes that's for sure therefore oh wait for them and have you out in the cold or that people or this person looking at you sideways so somebody was again painting a story or painting a negative light onto what you how you live your life or something like this so that you were left out in the cold so this could have been a past energy i'm getting as well so a past energy could have maybe tried to tell certain people and plant this in their this person's head put that seed of doubt in that person's head so that it gets to that person that type of energy um this person is being found out and they like they don't maybe they didn't realize the consequences like oh what if this person figures it out then i'm never gonna probably be able to talk to that person again mm, that's probably true because who does that that's a malicious it, like that's such a manipulative thing to do to try to get into somebody's mental like and plant some sort of idea or lie like how like i don't know because I don't know if people don't understand like how mental how like that works how sending negative energy how when it goes back to you and you don't realize it like until you're in that energy like oh maybe this is because like um, i somebody can maybe think that they deserve whatever karma they're going through because they know how they did you dirty or something this person maybe you're looking at this person's side where somebody is seeing maybe if you know something they're trying to figure something out they're trying to see how you're like re like what you're like it's like when someone trying to like feel have feelers out to see how you're feeling or something like do they know are they gonna be like in a negative mood towards me or something like this the truth is revealed the truth was revealed and so the truth is revealed there's you know even now in this moment um rushing in to be with you that's what i got this person could be rushing in to be with you because they had illusions about you temperance you're this earth angel yeah the hermit spiritual teacher virgo sagittarius i see the justice and the fool meaning justice is um uh karma but could also be libra uh the fool is aries scorpio oh, i don't know why I was slouching. I just saw wealth. So you could be very wealthy. The lovers, Gemini. There's definitely some sort of decision. Maybe somebody feels, maybe there was some sort of like, somebody was jealous. So they wanted somebody to ghost. Maybe this was the reason why. Yeah, this is definitely, I'm getting like something to do with matching tattoos. This person wanted to be just like you or something like this. Yeah, four of cups. This person's being left out in the cold, though, because you're receiving this ace of cups, and they're jealous of that. All, all out of envy and jealousy. Yeah, from the past. This could be somebody from your past. Or something like this. Six of wands. Yeah, because you're held in high honor. Nobody can knock you off that throne that you stood on. And this person doesn't like it that they were not chosen so again it's chosen in a sense too that you're the sun this light this this energy that you know you give to others it's so okay now i'm getting so somebody could have tried to copy what you do for work they could have tried to copy the way that you dress maybe the way that you talk but it's uh, all about the energy you can't copy energy it's impossible 
they wanted you to walk away from what was like meant for you your legacy your they wanted to because of greed somebody wanted you to hold back they wanted you to continuously juggle things be in the two of pentacles constantly having to you know i don't know maybe this is somebody juggling two people maybe this is somebody wanting to keep a masculine energy maybe somebody wanting to go towards you or you going towards your person somebody from your past if you're a masculine definitely try to um, mirror a, a situation or something like that queen of swords so queen of swords is somebody who uses their words with like you know they have they're speaking some sort of truth or they're speaking some sort of yeah they're speaking on something queen of swords is also somebody very logical very intelligent there's definitely some sort of abrupt shift happening um maybe because maybe this is two people we have queen of swords nine of cups you could be somebody very young vibrant somebody who um or this could have been somebody yeah nine of cups is somebody who gets all their wishes fulfilled I picked six cards before for the first pile, so we're just going to do six piles. Oh, and the Justice came, card came out in that reading. So maybe some of you guys are coming from the first pile, Justice. Um, but somebody is definitely watching you. Let's see. They're seeing you in this Nine of Pentacles energy. Oh, I'm sorry, not Nine of Pentacles, King of Pentacles. Maybe this is somebody, maybe you could be somebody very much in your money or in your something like this. There could have been a couple. They were watching you. Something's changing. Um, Two of Pentacles, is, these people are going to be left out on the cold. Somebody's walking away from them. Justice is coming in. There was definitely some sort of illusion. Seven of Swords, the moon. Somebody was juggling something. Yeah. This Empress, this Empress with somebody else. Who juggles an Empress? Somebody's in some sort of eight of swords. They're in their feelings. Or they're in their head because something changed. There's definitely something that's changing. Like something's happening when it comes to like something being illuminated. Somebody's crown is falling off. Also, I'm getting could be a Libra sign or just could be somebody that somebody's coming in and bringing in some sort of karma. This is they're smacking down on, you know something when, on who has been you know making them feel like they're in tumultuous waters like their emotions going up and down up and down they want to heal the situation three of pentacles yeah definitely want to work together there was definitely some sort of competition somebody was trying to create some sort of heartache could have been an emperor energy or a king of wands or it could have been three people king of cups queen of cups king of wands um what was it? Emperor. Somebody is in the Nine of Swords. It could be somebody in your family or due to some sort of family or some sort of union or partnership. Or maybe that you're in your bag, your money, you are healing. Ten of Pentacles, you haven't missed out on your opportunities. And this is the chariot, meaning you move forward. But also, if somebody did something deceitful, this person... The law is smacking down on them or this, they've done something that, you know, maybe against you. Maybe they tried to do something to take you to court. Someone's going to be giving you some sort of gift or this is a gift for you, some apology because you've moved past this energy and somebody cursed themselves because you were ready for whatever it was that they were coming, bringing your way. You already had the, like the insight, the knowledge, the strategy to overcome this. And everybody's seeing you like this, a sweetheart. Somebody could want to take care of you. I was also getting something to do with somebody wants to put a baby in you. I'm just kidding. No, somebody could be hesitant, your family, your friends, maybe somebody just in general. There's some sort of hesitancy or somebody was feeling hesitant. Six of cups, see, maybe because there was some sort of conflict from the past, but you, you um, defended yourself and now this person has to walk away four of cups they've missed some sort of opportunity yep because they were being sneaky seven of swords and this is being illuminated two of wands definitely you've taken a leap because i just saw the fool again 
you've taken a leap into not knowing where you're going to go, but having the faith and courage that you're going to get there or you're going to get to that destination or whatever outcome you want and knowing that you're going to, it's always going to work out in your favor. So, all right, I'm going to leave you guys at that. Let me know if this resonates. Also, that second pile, um, age difference could be a, something in that or some sort of difference, you know, whether it's uh, like boy um i mean feminine masculine or i was i was gonna get tall short no or your age difference so maybe there were friends family maybe the difference of age or something that this could also be maturity level but um this something along that is like this that energy and that pile there's two different types of energies where there was somebody trying to get in between this and this could have been somebody connected to your person i'm getting to the masculine energy or it could have been in the feminine or there was a masculine energy that was connected in some sort of way um they could have been creating i, I was getting boy male and female could have been together both together teamed up against one person or could be you know somebody on both sides on both you know masculine and feminine side that is trying to create some sort of blockage all right anyways again like i said we're gonna finish that reading off i'll see you guys in my next video let me know if this resonates stay in positivity don't let anything knock you down and i'll see you guys next time take care bye